Hello everyone. Controlling Child Marriage The Native Marriage Act or Civil Marriage Act 1872 signified legislative action in prohibiting child marriage. It had a limited impact as the act was not applicable to Hindus, Muslims and other recognized faiths. The relentless efforts of a Parsi reformer B.M. Malabari were rewarded by the enactment of the Age of Consent Act in 1891, which forbade the marriage of girls below the age of 12. The case of Rukma Bai pushed the reformers to get the Age of Consent Act passed. Rukma Bai Rao, who went on to become India's first woman physician to practice medicine, was married to Dadaji Bikaji at the age of 11. However, with the support of her stepfather, Shakaram Arjun, she did not join her husband for some time during which she continued with her education. When, after some 12 years of marriage, Dadaji Bikaji demanded that she join him as his wife, she refused. This led to the Dadaji Bikaji vs. Rukma Bai case of 1884. Dadaji petitioned the Bombay High Court for restitution of conjugal rights of a husband. Rukma Bai questioned the validity of her marriage with Dadaji as the marriage had taken place before she had arrived at years of discretion and as such she refused to be bound to it. Justice Robert Hill Pinney dismissed Dadaji's petition, saying that Rukma Bai had been married off in helpless infancy and hence could not be forced to join her husband. However, an appeal was sought against the judgment after many criticized it as diminishing Hindu customs and in 1887, Pinney's decision was overturned by Chief Justice Sir Charles Sargent and Justice Farhan, Rukma Bai was told to live with her husband. Rukma Bai declared that she would rather undergo any punishment meted out by the court rather than go to live with her husband. It is said that it was only with Queen Victoria's intervention that the sentence of imprisonment was set aside. It is also said that even the conservatives among the Indians as well as the British government did not want Rukma Bai to be punished for her stand. The Rukma Bai case became one of the most publicized court cases in India in the 19th century and brought the, brought the issue of child marriage and the rights of the woman to the forefront. A group of Indian reformers such as Bairamji, Malabari and Ramabai Ranade formed the Rukma Bai Defense Committee to bring the case to public attention. After finishing her studies, Rukma Bai obtained the position as Chief Medical Officer in Sorat. During her long and distinguished career in medicine, she continued writing against child marriage and women's seclusion or parda system. The Child Marriage Restraint Act 1929, popularly known as Sarda Act, which came into force in 1930, further pushed up the marriage age to 18 and 14 for boys and girls respectively. Harpila Sarda was an Indian academic and judge who became member of the Central Legislative Assembly from Ajmer Merwara. He was a follower of Dayanand Saraswati and a member of the Arya Samaj. In Free India, the Child Marriage Restraint Amendment Act 1978 raised the age of marriage for girls from 15 to 18 years and for boys from 18 to 21. Like, share and subscribe to support the channel. Thank you. Bye.